Hey, let's head back to the voicemail of Truth and Reason. This one uh, about a hypothetical question with the Browns quarterback situation. This is Glenn Studeman currently in Utah, and my question is purely hypothetical because no one except possibly myself and Jacoby thinks this could happen. But what if at 11 games, by some miracle, the Browns are 8-3 and three or 9-2, and two. Jacoby's doing just enough so that they win games or not to lose games, and the Browns know that Deshaun is rusty. Any chance they consider keeping Jacoby in, not to mess with a good thing? Thank you. you got a great host and always great guests. I love your show. Bye. As always, appreciate all of the uh, the voicemails. Let's welcome in Brad Ward, BrownsWire.com, All Eyes on Cleveland Podcast. So, Brad, uh, Watson's eligible to return to the Browns facility on October 10th. Uh, he can resume practicing on the 14th per league sources. That's to, to knock the rust off. He's eligible to play December 4th. When December 4th rolls around, he's their quarterback. Um, Jacoby Brissett, if he does that, is playing himself into the ability to go and, and sign a nice lucrative contract with somebody else and maybe get a shot to be a starter. But I don't think there's any way when Deshaun Watson is able to play that the Browns don't insert him immediately as their quarterback. Yeah, I would have to agree completely. There's uh, He's the guy, right? You spent $230 million on him. You're not going to sit on him regardless of what Jacoby Brissett does. If he performs over his head and the Browns miraculously have a record with like eight or nine wins, then that's fantastic. Uh, maybe he wants to be the long-term backup here or something, or uh, and they can sign him to a nice deal, or maybe he gets another starting opportunity. But either way, when uh, – the time comes for Watson to be able to start. He will be under center. I feel very confident in that. And, uh, um, yeah, I mean, I just don't see any other way around it. I think you'll hear a groundswell of fans, certainly if that was the case in this hypothetical situation, pounding the table for Brissett to continue to start kind of uh, back to Brian Hoyer and Johnny Manziel type days uh, conversations. But um, Deshaun Watson is a whole different entity, so. Yeah, and, and and again, um, Jacoby Brissett probably would expect it as well. You know, when you're the backup yeah. quarterback, you're you expect it, and that's kind of what it is.